Hey guys, uh, Lana Baldwin here. Today I'm just doing a video uh, a little bit about myself and where I come from in terms of, I wouldn't say career because I've never really had a career. Uh, I was never, I was never one that wanted to go to university. I was never really one for school. I uh, just was never really great at school. I'm more of a person that's learns by people showing me and then once someone showed me then I can do it straight away so school was not that great for me but I understand that school is for a lot of other people and some people thrive in that but that just wasn't me so when I finished school I didn't really know where I wanted to go and where I wanted to take my life uh, but a couple of my friends and I decided to go on a working holiday to the USA and we worked, we all worked at different summer camps and we met up after and travelled so that was really awesome uh, and then I decided to go back the next year after that and I guess the reason for me telling you that was because not everything has to be about school and university and colleges and you can still do great things and not, you know, have a degree. I think sometimes people, especially school teachers, really push that pressure on all of us um, that we have to have a degree and we have to do this and we have to do that when really that doesn't make some people happy. That didn't make me happy. I'm just more happy doing something that I love and every time that I have wanted to, you know, achieve something, really wanted to achieve it I have achieved it uh, so that one of that was one of them was traveling for me I've done a lot of traveling I love traveling uh, I will travel and travel and travel until I die I love traveling I love meeting new people new cultures eating different foods all of it um, and then after that I then um, decided I was going to move states um, my home state was uh, Melbourne, Victoria, and I decided to move to Perth, Western Australia, which is absolutely stunning over there. And I still wish I lived there now, but I don't. But at the time, uh, it was an awesome experience. I was young, I had fun, and a big part of me wanting to move there was I wanted to work in the mines, and it took me a while. Uh, I didn't get it straight away. But I ended up getting in and it was very hard work but the pay was well worth it and I loved I loved the experience. It was something completely different. Uh, a lot of people quit when they get there because it's literally in the middle of nowhere. There's nothing around. But I was really proud of the four years that I did that. I did a two-in-one roster. I did a four-in-one roster. Super hard, super challenging and super rewarding. It's definitely not a job you could do, you know, all the time, but I'm really proud of what I achieved with that and how long I stuck it out for because, yeah, a lot of people do quit after a while. So that's another thing I achieved, but what stopped me was that I met my husband and it was just too hard on us, too hard on a relationship and... It just wasn't worth it anymore so I ended up quitting that job and coming back to be with my man and we had already got married and then within a month of being back I was pregnant so yeah so the I guess the point of me um, telling you this is just that you don't have to have a degree to achieve things in life and what you want to achieve in your life might be different to what I want, you know, what I want to achieve in my life. And it's all whatever makes you happy, makes you happy. Whatever makes me happy, makes me happy. Everything can be an achievement if you make it. So, yeah, I just wanted to share that. Um, and I guess what got me to them places was that I really wanted it. I really made it happen. And I had to have that mindset that, if I want this to happen, I have to think it's going to happen. I have to make it happen. And it happened. So some of it's just mindset. Uh, 
in saying that there have been things in life that haven't that haven't happened for me that I've wanted and maybe that was because subconsciously maybe I really didn't want that as bad as I wanted other things but I truly believe that if if you really want something that bad you will make it happen no matter what and I truly believe that uh, so I'd really like it if you could comment below and like my video thanks